today in algebra, we talked about the distributive property in like terms. A term is a part of an algebraic expression. So in this example, we have one, two, three terms. There are three because there are one, two, three things being separated by a plus or a minus sign. The coefficient, that's a new vocabulary word, the coefficient is the number part of a term, the number in front of a variable. So in the example we just looked at, 4 is the coefficient of 4x squared, because 4 is the number in front of the variable. And 1 is the coefficient of x, because there is no number in front of x, so it's understood to be 1. Now we need to talk about the distributive property. a, b, and c are numbers or variables. If I have a times b plus c, where b plus c is in parentheses, if b and c are not the same, I can't add them together. So instead, I'm going to distribute them by doing a times b, which is ab, plus a times c, which is ac. And that's just a formula that we'll be using over and over. In this problem, we can still do our PEMDAS because 3 plus 7 is, of course, 10. And I'm multiplying that by 4, and 4 times 10 is 40. Now, if these two were not alike, I could not add them together. So you'll see I could have also done 4 times 3, which is 12, plus 4 times 7, which is 28, and 28 plus 12 is 40. So it'll give us the same answer. If you can't add it together, you'll want to use PEMDAS. If you can't, you'll want to use your, order, your distributive property. Let's go through a few more examples. If I do 6 times x, I get 6x, and 6 times 2 is 12. Be sure that you're always multiplying when you distribute. If I multiply a times b, I get ab. If I multiply a times 4, I get 4a. And the plus sign stays in the middle. If I multiply 9 times x, I get 9x. And then 9 times negative y is negative 9y. And then 9 times 5 is 45. I multiply the numbers, and I keep the signs in the middle the same. Let's just choose a few more on this side. So I'm going to go with this one right here. Negative 4 times n, negative 4n, and distribute again, negative 4 times 2 is negative 8. Notice right here the sign changed because the sign out front was negative. We went through the rest of these examples in class. I'll be happy to go with, over them with you if you'd like on some of your free time or in tutorials. On the back side of our notes, we talked about like terms which are terms that have the same variable raised to the same power. Basically, that means they look exactly the same. Same letter, same exponent. I have two categories here. The first category is terms that are like terms. Notice that these both have x's. They don't have the same number in front, but they both have x, and they both have, both have an exponent of 1. In this one, they have x, y squared. The x is by itself, and the y is squared, so those are like terms. In this category, I have two things that are not alike because I have x squared and I have x. Those are not alike, so they are not like terms. This one has a squared, this one does not. That means I can't add them together. So, to do things with like terms, I add things that are alike. I add their coefficients and leave the exponents alone. If I need to do distributive property first, we'll do that. Just have a quick minute, so I'm going to go over just a few of these examples. If I want to add together 3x plus x, I have 4x. And 3 plus 1 is 4. That's where that's coming from. On this one, I could add together 6x plus x, or 6x plus 1x, and that's 7x. I can't add the 2y because x and y are not the same. So I'm just going to leave the 2y alone. On this one, I have n, n squared, and n. The n's are alike. The n squared is not alike. So I have n minus 8n, which is negative 7n, plus 3n squared. My next class is about to start, so I'm going to go real quickly through this last one with you. I want to distribute here first. Negative 5 times x is negative 5x. Negative 5y is negative 5y plus 6x. I have x terms that are like. Negative 5 and positive 6 make just x minus 5y, and that's my final answer. If you do have an assignment on this, I hope this little review has helped. If you have questions, let me know.